Oh snap, I'm back here again. It's been a while, guys, since I've shown my face here, but hi, my name is Rich or Nerd Fury, for those of y'all who don't know me, and today I bring y'all my portion of 6 KO So What Week that Chase had against Ruby Medieval, which I found it really hard that he 6 0 her. But, um, yeah, let's just see how this plays out. So, Chase is going to lead off with a Celebi. Uh, Ruby's going to lead off with her Rotom, probably expecting his Poly to lead, not too shabby on her part. Ruby's going to instantly go out hard switch over into Gengar. Chase is going to make a safe switch. Not safe switch. Safe play and go for Giga Drain. No reason to over predict uh, massively first turn. And ooh, we have a double switch. We have a double switch, ladies and gentlemen. Ooh, going out to Heatran. Okay. Alright. Chase is going to switch out into. Oh, Polytoad. Okay. Not really the best double switch. I guess Chase was just like, hey, might as well go ahead and get Rain up. Um, Alright Chase, tell me you're going to predict the Gastrodon and go for Toxic. Tell me you're going to predict the Gastrodon and go for Toxic. Nope. Okay. Nope. Just goes for Scald. Just goes for Scald. I think this is a physically defensive Politoed too, because this team has a specially defensive uh, Dragonite. So, but yeah. Nope. Now he goes for Toxic and everyone's just poisoning everybody. It's like, you know, one big, I hate you, I want you to secretly die, so I'm going to secretly poison your food. It must be the Acid Rain. It's gotta be the Acid Rain. Uh, so Chase is going to switch over into Celebi again. Oh, she's doubling yet again into Gengar? Yes! Look at that. Good play, Ruby. Good job. How does, how does, how, how does the 6 0 happen? What? She's playing so well. Uh, probably gonna get a free substitute right here. Yep. And Chase is just gonna go out into Dragonite, which, um, like I said, because I faced this team before, is a specially defensive Dragonite. <clears throat> Just gonna break multi scale with Shadow Ball. This is hardly gonna do anything. Damn! That, that Dragonite spread, man. <laughs> Too bulky. So, Chase is gonna fire off a Thunder. I am expecting a Disable to possibly occur, but then again, Chase probably isn't going to fall for that and click a different move. As actually, Ruby just goes and sets up a different substitute. Okay. So, Chase is gonna click Hurricane this time because it is his other or his stab move that he runs on this particular Dragonite spread. Um, is she subsplit? I don't know if she's subsplit or not. <clears throat> because, um, yeah, she keeps on, she, she's, uh, she's just sub, she must be subsplit. That's weird, I've never seen subsplit with leftovers. So yeah, Chase is again going to predict the, uh, either the switch or another sub, go for Dragon Tail, it'll still break it because it is a Gengar with frail, 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 you know, defenses. Um, yeah, I'm expecting Ruby to pain split right here. Yep, there we go. That's gonna that's gonna really damage um, that Dragonite, make it a little bit more vulnerable. As Chase is going to go for the oh no, he's gonna get the para. This man is so getting the para. This man is so getting the wow. Okay, yeah, I can see where this six zero is gonna come from now, because I mean, as of right now, her team is slow. Her team is really, really slow. Like the fastest potential thing on her team now is either uh, Heatran or her Rotom. But I mean, damn, yeah, th this is not looking good. So he's gonna Hurricane, maybe predicting Gastrodon, just firing off. Yeah, Rotom has leftovers. Oh, this team is now really. Oh man, this is this is such a slow team. She probably be in her best interest to Volt Switch if she has it. Chase is gonna go out into Celebi. No, she doesn't because she's more of a probably a bulkier set, so she probably just has Thunderbolt and a reason to have Volt Switch. Um, yeah, this isn't looking good. I might see where this 6 might start to unravel. Chase is probably going to set up a nasty plot right here. In comes the Paralyzed Gang. Yep. Mm, okay. Yeah, I can see this. I can see the stuff going downhill for Ruby. Because, yeah, the, the Paralyzation on Gengar with the Thunder really 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 hurt her so yeah he's probably gonna fire off uh yep hidden power ice and yeah down goes gengar oh she's in a bind right now she's in a bind she's in a real bind if he actually has earth power i forget whether or not he has it on this set or not uh yeah she's going to scout for that very nicely into skarmory yep he does have earth power so he has nasty pot three attacks um it's fine though, she can either just, you know, Whirlwind or Brave Bird for some really big damage. Let's see what kind of Skarmory she is. She is a defensive setup spot. Ruby! No, Ruby, no, why'd you set up spikes? No, 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 unless you thought you were supposed to defensive and could take that better, but I mean, still, that's... Oh, no. 
Oh yeah, yeah. This is because I mean, all she has left is a Don fan, which is I don't even know what Don fan's gonna do to Celebi, except you know, live on sturdy, and I, 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 I don't even know. Oh, to ooh, toxic. Okay, so she can kind of play a little bit of like mind games uh, with this. Um, okay, Chase, if you're smart, you'll just click Earth Power, because, I mean, it hits everything except Rotom, which you will still outspeed. So, oop, in comes Heatran, tell me, tell me he did it, tell me he probably, wow, he just went for Giga Drain. Really, Chase? Really? You don't even know if this Heatran is, I mean, it doesn't matter, because, I mean, Rain is up, but, I mean, still, you don't know if Heatran outpaces you, but, I mean, you can still probably take one hit, but, I mean, man, come on. Yeah, you outpace Heat. wow, okay, yeah, this is... Dang, all he has to do now is literally just like click Giga Drain and win. Man, dang. I mean, I'm not ripping this, but I mean, this had the potential to be a really, really good, intense match, but that paralyzation on Gengar, damn, that hurt. That stung. That stung bad. She's gonna go ahead and Gastrodon. Um, I guess just double over, yeah, back over to Don Fan just to give him as little HP recovery as possible, but I mean, there's no hope because her other two guys are slower than Celebi, both of which are weak to Giga Drain, so I mean, there's there's no way she can potentially try and Toxic Solve. She should have probably, um, once Gengar died, probably should have gone out into Don Fan, um, and then just fired off the Toxic, as opposed to doing that, because I mean, or she should have, you know, whirlwinded with Skarmory, that would have been a little bit better play, or at least she'd have fired off a Brave Bird, because I mean, had she would have Brave Birded right there, probably, you know, she probably would have... I gar yeah, I guarantee you that probably that would have been dead, at least by now with some of that, but I'm not, I, you know, I can't say for certain, but <clears throat> wow, that was a total contradiction. But no, anyways, yeah, that was that was the game, 6KO So What Week. Guys, I hope you enjoy. Um, good game to both Ruby and Chase. Thank you all for watching, I really do appreciate it. My link will probably be in the, de probably be in the description if you want to come check me out randomly. And yeah, I thank you again, guys, and I'll see you later. Peace.